So for today's video, I am going to be doing the DMI tag. Now, I know that this is an old tag. I know that this was something that people did um, even before ASMR was popular. It was something that people commonly did clear back in like 2013, 2012, maybe even 2011. Um, I don't really care if something's like an old trend or not really popular anymore if I think it's fun or I like watching it or I know other people still like watching it I'll probably still do it because I've never been like the type of person that just does something because it's in or trendy if that makes sense so uh yeah so I apologize my microphone does look kind of crooked um it is just the way that it's sitting but yeah, so let's just get into it. I should have looked up the, um, I should have looked it up first, but face ID never works, I swear. I'm gonna go on Tumblr, which I do not have a Tumblr account just because I have enough social media, but, um, I do, um, I do, like, use Tumblr, like, as far as the app, I just don't have an account, which, if you don't know, you can use the Tumblr app without having an account, um, but anyway, so yeah, let's just get into it, okay, so there is 50 questions, so I don't know if I'm gonna go through all these, because honest with you guys I feel like crap which I know I say that a lot but that is just my life um my ribs are so sore so sore I've been extremely short of breath lately and the weather is not helping so yeah this is probably gonna be overall a pretty short video but I will do my best you know to make it a decent length also I know my makeup looks like two different colors which I don't know why. I feel like this lighting is just really yellow, which it actually is because I do not have my regular light on. I just have a lamp and then very yellow toned string lights, so that is why my makeup looks like this. I'm also very pale, so even if the foundation matches me, it oxidizes, so. Okay, so the first times I know I'm going to drop my phone in this video, I have not been able to find a way to like set my phone down where it's not gonna i don't even know i'm just if you guys have any suggestions please let me know but my phone is constantly falling i've tried putting it on flat surfaces i've tried you know putting things behind it to keep it sturdy it just does not work and i've even tried taking the case off and for some reason that seemed to make it worse because of the slipperiness but anyway like i said let's just get into the video also do you guys like my crazy anatomy um pop socket or whatever it's called literally like you can't really tell it's Grey's Anatomy because of the art style but it's like a cartoon Grey's Anatomy but okay so the first question is what are you wearing I am wearing a red t-shirt it is just a red polyester t-shirt that I got from DJ Maxx DJ Maxx Max. and then I'm wearing a sheen of pajama pants the leopard ones that was in my sheen haul and I'm wearing regular just basic socks they're beach and they're also from DJ Max so yeah and the second question is ever been in love okay let me just ask you this do fictional characters count do fictional characters count because I have one hundred percent been in love with Derek Shepard and Mark Sloan, okay? It took me a very long time to admit that until I realized that pretty much everyone has been at one point, so. But outside of that, no, I've never even dated anyone. Um, ever had a terrible breakup. That takes me 
know a very short amount of time so it's just overwhelming and kind of hard to think about other things sometimes when you know that that happens okay the next question is how tall are you and i do believe i am like five two and a half or five three although i'm probably a little bit shorter than five three because my sister is five three and she is a little taller than me but i'm pretty sure she's like five four because i don't know i can just tell okay how much do you weigh um i haven't weighed myself which i do sometimes have to weigh myself um on a chronic basis due to my medical issues that affect like my stomach and my metabolism and all of that but the last time i weighed myself i was like 121 or 123 i think which is actually the best weight i've ever been i was underweight the majority of my life extremely underweight and i'm very thankful that i'm at a you know okay weight right now i hope it stays that way it's probably not going to because i said that but you know kind of hope for the best okay any tattoos no i do not have any tattoos but i am going to be getting a tattoo on the 11th of august and i'm really excited i'm going to be getting a tattoo like right here like right in like the inner part of my arm not the entire inner part of my arm but like right here like on the side lining i guess i don't know what you would call that i don't know what that's called but and i am yeah I'm, like i said i'm really excited about it but yeah so no i don't have any tattoos right now but i will be getting one soon and then any piercings no i do not have any piercings um i did have my ears pierced twice but the first time i was closed and the second time i got a really bad infection and after that i just didn't get around to it again it wasn't necessarily anything intentional it just wasn't really of importance to me okay uh otp okay otp one true pairing literally um i can i forget what otp means sometimes but i did remember this time uh in general like my otp of all time i don't necessarily know if i have like one otp that i love more than any other uh tv or real life couple because a lot of the times it changes like i'll go through phases where i'm like super obsessed with you know a specific ship and then you know then then you know other ones at other times but in general i would say my otp is Derek and addison from grace anatomy yes yes let's take a moment of silence for you all to you know get your breath because you're so shocked but yeah i've been judged so hardcore for that but i really don't care you know what i mean like it's it's not it shouldn't really have that much of an effect on you if somebody you don't even know shares the same opinion with you or not so yeah addison and eric from grace anatomy are my otp okay uh something uh oh um favorite show my favorite show right now is glee but i don't necessarily have a favorite show of all time i grew up on all the like 2000s disney sitcoms so those are definitely my favorite um but i love grace anatomy i love glee um i like keeping up with the kardashians the older episodes um dance moms i really liked when i was younger so i mean yeah i have a lot of different favorite shows i guess you could say favorite band or favorite bands i feel like i've answered a lot of these questions in the uh in another video but my favorite band is the fray 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 which i feel like the fray is super underrated but most people do know this song how to save a life and the fray is who sings how to save a life so yeah um favorite song or if there's something you miss um i definitely miss my childhood for sure 100 percent um favorite song i don't my favorite song of all time is so small by carrie underwood and the climb by miley cyrus but i listen to all different types of music and i kind of go through phases where you know i'll have a different favorite song but like overall i think that 
those are like my absolute most favorite. Okay, um, how old are you? How old are you? How old are you? How old are you? I just turned 19 yesterday. Yesterday, 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 yesterday. Uh, Zodiac sign. I am a Leo. Quality you look for in a partner. Um, honesty. Loyalty. Um. Patience. The same, like, political views and also, like, morals and, uh, morals and, sorry, my dad was calling me for dinner, um, morals and values and all that, which I'm, I know some people think it's so judgmental to be like, oh, well, I wouldn't date this person if they don't have the same political views as me, but it's not, like, I'm not as picky about it as it seems. It's just the fact that, you know, me and my entire family have pretty severe health issues. And, you know, if you're going to be against masks and against vaccines and a big, you know, big on, like, doing all these things that, that harm people like us, you know, I'm not going to want to date you or be friends with you or any of that, you know what I mean? So it's not as political as it seems, but, yeah, um, favorite quote. I have a lot of favorite quotes. Favorite actor. Patrick Dempsey. Um, favorite color. My favorite color is red and orange. Lost me or loud music or soft music. It depends on my mood. But I like to keep music loud in terms of like the volume. Where do you go when you're sad? I like to go to Target when I'm in a bad mood. Um, I kind of just like to hang out at Target a lot even if I don't really buy anything. I guess that's like my go-to place when I'm, you know, sad or upset or anything, you know, negative. I just kind of like to go to Target. Um, how long does it take you to shower? It kind of depends. Um, sometimes it takes me 15 minutes. Sometimes it takes me half an hour. It depends on like if I'm washing my hair, shaving, all of that. It does take me a long time. Also, sometimes if I'm having a really off day where I'm really dizzy because um, showering can just be really hard for me some days. How long does it take you to get ready in the morning? It really depends on how much time I have and how early it is. Like, I had to get up at 4.30 in the morning for my graduation. And because I didn't have a lot of time and also because it was so early, I was ready within like a half hour. But if I know I'm going to have a couple hours or so before I have to leave and it's also not that early, then I sometimes I'll take like a two hours. It kind of depends. Uh been in a physical fight. No, I have not been in a physical fight. Turn on, uh, scrubs. I've said this in another video, but I literally, male or female, scrubs is like, like, make a turn on. Uh, turn off, um, egomaniacs, because it literally just makes me want to, you know, like, deflate their ego, like, pop their balloon of ego, you know what I mean? Okay, unfortunately, my hands are shaky, but I think I might have to hold, hold my phone for the rest of the video because I am getting tired of it falling. But anyway, so yeah, that's my turn off, uh, main turn off, I guess. Reason I joined YouTube, I joined YouTube because I, you know, wanted to kind of, uh, just make a difference in the world somehow, you know, because I can't really work or necessarily do much to make a difference in the outside world, technically speaking, because I can't work or drive or that kind of thing, but I wanted to make a difference in the way that I can and with what I have access to. Uh, meaning behind your YouTube name. My YouTube name is literally just a combination of my first and last name, and then ASR, so... Yeah, pretty self-explanatory. Uh, last book you read, I pretty much only read fanfiction. I think the last, the last fanfiction that I, like, completed was, it's called Satan's Sister. It was a Grey's Anatomy fanfiction about Addison having a sister on Wattpad. It's really good. And it hasn't been updated yet, but I really love that one. Um, last person you talked to, uh, the last person I talked to was my mom relationship between you and the person you last texted. I do 
believe the last person I texted was my mom as well. And me and my mom are very close. Like, we're two peas in a pod. In a pod, I mean. A uh, place you want to visit. I really want to go to New York. I also want to go to Philly, 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 Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Uh, which, you actually pass Philadelphia. There's actually a way you can pass Philadelphia on your way to New York, so... Hopefully, I'll get to see both someday. Uh, last place you are, um, the kitchen before this. Uh, last song you sang. Um, I think the last song that I sang was a Randy Travis song. Uh, I'm gonna probably end this video now just because I have been 